Hello everybody and welcome back to the channel. So obviously there is some breaking news uh, coming out of Leeds United. We all did a video yesterday. I did one this morning as well. So we've had to move the Rodrigo one to the next day because obviously I always try to bring out at least one video at 8 a.m. That's my schedule. I don't mean to bring out like two to three videos a day, but it, it is what it is. This is a Leeds United channel. This is all about Leeds United news and I'm the daily leads and I try to bring out consecutive daily basis or d consecutive uh, Leeds United content, shall we say. And uh, as you can see, it's pretty much confirmed that Xavi uh, Garcia will be replacing Jesse Marsh. He'll be his successor. And will it be a big risk from the board? I mean, we took that risk with Skabala, didn't we? And we know that we needed to bring in a, in, in a manager. And we've got to stand by this now. I personally think like everybody at the club is to blame, but a lot of Leeds United fans will sit there and I will say that the board is 100% to blame. And I, I feel like everybody is, is to blame. The, 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 the players got Jesse Marsh sacked in a sense because obviously there were positives. Like I'm not going to sit here and slag Jesse Marsh off completely because there were positive takes out of the game. And I just thought if he could implement a different style of play or like tweak his system up just a little bit, and if we had Rodrigo still uh, still back from injury, a couple of times, fair enough, his man management didn't really go to plan. But at the same time, we can't really sit here and, and just uh, bash Jesse Marsh. We have to and just look at the, the bigger picture. The players are to blame uh, with with how Paul have been, the body language, the confidence and everything, and with then Jesse Marsh and his comments, and then the board with having no plan. So to me, I felt like there's a big toxicity uh, surrounding Leeds United uh, when it comes from the top to the, the players as well. But as we can see, uh, Xavi Gassi is probably going to be coming the next Leeds United manager. BBC Sport have announced it. Adam Pope has come out and stated that uh, the training has been uh, postponed or uh, put on hold for today because obviously there's the been preparations for Xavi Gassi to come in. So it's looking like he's going to be taking charge in the next coming hours or the next 24 hours. So just stay tuned for that. It's not fully percent confirmed yet, but it's, it's all over one football, uh, Fabrizio Romano, BBC Sport, these types, and, and uh, Phil Hay as well, he's come out and said that he's optimistic with the, the, the signing of, um, of Javi Garcia. So all these journalists, all these radio pr presenters are all coming out saying that he's pretty much about to be appointed the Leeds United manager. And to me, with the four-month deal, this is what Leeds United have offered, a four-month deal. Uh, to help save Leeds United from relegation plus bonuses. So I don't know what's going to happen there in the future, whether Leeds United are going to be looking at this and be like, okay, well, maybe we should stick with Xavi Garcia for the long term, or we maybe should go in for the likes of Arnie Slot or the likes of Iriola again. So we're just going to have to wait and see. But we've got to try and focus on now. We've got to try and focus on uh, trying to keep Leeds United in the team. Uh, in the Premier League, there's 15 games to go, so there's still over 40 points to play. So hopefully uh, Leeds United can stay in, in the Premier League. Anyway, guys, make sure you like, comment, subscribe for daily uploads, uh, daily updates, and I'll try and bring out more updates later later through the day and stuff like that i mean i know there'll be other content creators as well but i just wanted to obviously give my own perspective and my own opinion about it. anyway guys thank you so much for watching make sure you like comment subscribe and we'll see you in the next one peace